Hi, welcome. We are on uh, Arch Merge, and then specifically we're on Arch Merged. And what I want to do as topic is one of my GitHubs that I have. I want to try out if um, it still works, if my scripts still work. I just made a tutorial about 33 Arc themes you can download, but you can make a 36 if you want to. So if you want to make three new colored themes based on my scripts, then it's here. So the arc theme Colora GitHub and it's all explained here what to do and you'll find more information on erudubois.be as well. As you can see, it's been tested on Linux Mint, on Solus, uh, what else, Arch Linux, Ubuntu. So it works on different kind of distros and I wanted to test it out now on Arch Merch or Arch merged with which is the same basically. Um, okay, let's go ahead and, and, and treat this as anybody in anyone else would do it. Um, let's find out if you just want to download them, but that's just for the guys from Linux Mint and all that. So we're really gonna build it. That's this one. So install the theme and get the source, blah blah blah. Alright, so we skipped already something here we need to go all the way up what we need to do is where is it i can't even find my own information strange here it is get the latest version from horst so that's what we need to do Control c doesn't mind don't doesn't matter what desktop you're on so i'm still on i3 because i was teaching in i3 uh, Arch Merge i3 15 16 articles how to work with i3 so control shift V is my yeah it's still on my screen key so we're cloning and where am I exactly cloning in okay my home directory that's good so I cloned now arc theme that's the new folder that's here that's the one I just did and then I'm gonna get my code my scripts con uh, control c and then here control shift v so now i have two elements okay let's have a look what do i have in eric i have arc theme and arc theme colora these two are the new ones i'm cutting them here and putting them on desktop this is my not only my real desktop, but it's my virtual desktop as well. So here I, I model along, I put my stuff. When everything is okay, I put it away in Dropbox or InSync. So this is trial and error. That's my desktop. This is the art theme coming from Horst. We appreciate Horst. Thank you for making such a nice theme and working so hard on it because it's always alive. It's always um, a lot of information there uh, about uh, what's what's still to do and, and what issues there are still are so it's it's alive and that's the main important thing it's uh, it's alive and, and people maintain it a lot of issues and he will solve them for us so we depend we depend like everything else in Linux we depend on others so thank you that said um, let's do what we're about to do that is I made some scripts to change the colors from uh, Horst. So what do we do? We first, actually, we can run one of these. So Ubuntu, Solus, Linux Mint, Arch Linux. That's the one I want now. I am on Arch Merge. That's basis of Arch Linux. So A, two A's and Telegos as well. So I'm gonna see if my script is still in order. That's also one of the goals of me now. Mm -hmm. Okay, the only thing we had to install is opti PNG, so optimize PNGs. And now it says we install all needed software depending on the distro you're on. Next up, figure out the color accent of your new Arc theme online or with GPIC or other software. Then change the color for the variable new color one in script one, change color, save and run script one. Okay, that being said, I have something, I've chosen a green one because I don't have anything green yet. So I'm gonna take my GPIC, I'm gonna say, sample me this one, that green, that green, and that green is the same, I don't know. 
it's a bit tricky in i3 but now it's the question of what green do I take um, what are we making we are actually changing the yellow things you see here this is also an arc theme the new mix color this color is what it will be green when we move over it the question is what green what is the nicest green out there here it was Mantis, I like the name Mantis. I think about uh, Kung Fu Panda then. Let's take that one. <laughs> yeah, I'm still a child in heart. So Mantis, all right, let's go for it. I have a color. Then, what else? Oh yeah, I probably lost the color anyway because what I need to do, um, let's follow the tutorial. Let's see if that's also in order. Oh my god, I clicked it away I guess. We can get rid of that so we can read better. So, what do we need to do? I git cloned it, I did it. Copy paste all scripts inside the directory arc theme color to arc theme. Copy paste also the open box. Yes, that's I was wondering if that was inside because I just noticed this one here. So we need to copy paste everything here, but actually we don't need that one or that one or that one or that one or that one since we ran it already, but we do need this one and that's what I wanted to check. So copy to host folder paste and now we're set to go. We need don't need this one again because we need to be in here in this folder. So the present working directory is the arc theme, the horse folder. And now we can start running the scripts if, 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 if we changed our color. And let's move this one to number 10, for instance. So here is the code. This is what I need to be changed. Change only this code, no hashtag before color code. But uh, I have to get my code again because I surely lost it already. So, control V, and then the hashtag gone. Save. So now I'm, I'm telling him everything that's blue, you start um, making it green, actually. That's what all this is about. Maybe another tutorial to, to go in detail about that, but it's a long story. It's days of work to figure out everything. All right, let's hope it still works. So anyway, we have the scripts. The color is now changed. Well, where was it? Here I need to run my first script, change the color. What it's going to do is going to find anything with the blue color and change it to the gray color. And then just for me, I wrote fix one, fix two, fix three, fix four, just to know where in the script it's, it's working. So I still know it's it's running. Voila, that's done. All CSS files, but also SVG files have been changed now to your color code, but PNGs will not be altered. So now we're gonna get rid of the PNGs by run number two, delete it, everything is gone. And now we're gonna make them again. And that takes a while. As you can see, everything is created. Let's take a look at what um, we're on GTK2. This is what I did until now. We can, it's probably gonna open number three. Uh, blah, 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 okay. Let's move it to a screen near you. That's uh, maybe best number nine. Voila, we don't need GPIC anymore. We set the color. So this is what we did. We changed with a simple script, everything that's blue inside of uh, arc theme into something, into something green. So that's nice, that's nice. Otherwise you have to really say to this thing here, bucket, and then uh, let's do it like this. And then you have to change manually every little item that's blue to green. I was not keen to do that. So I learned how to script. Okay, quitting, close but out saving, and still rendering. What should we do? 
we can do one more thing and then I'm gonna pause the movie is go into assets and here you see what he's doing so every little part that we need for our theme is going to be created that's what he's doing now rendering assets so we get a lot of icons yeah basically we start from an SVG and we put them in PNG format and then later on we can select it in our L experience for instance in i3 on or in your uh, theme manager let's pause it and wait for it to finish okay he just finished and he says, says to me run script number four to install the themes your themes will be installed in user share themes if you have already the art theme the blue one it will be overwritten do not worry we can install the original art theme again that's how the system of uh, Horst is written so we can't change it or why why is change uh, something that works huh? so okay uh, number four let's run it and that's the re the actual configuration of the, the build uh, the make uh, that happens and that's done already arc arc dark and arc darker now we have um, we have we created already this green thing and it's called arc and arc dark and arc darker but we should actually yeah, move it eh? run script 5 to copy and rename the themes we should get the blue ones back so first off what was the name again maybe we can use um, mantis i think it was how do we write it like that mantis let's give it that name let's see well number five it was moving and rename the themes okay bash no such file or directory okay alice what's happening so uh-huh the only thing i can come up with and that's probably it Control h and that's that oh yeah that's not the issue so let's uh, try again ah yeah backup yeah 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 got it got it got it got it so dot sh i really got get uh, got to get rid of my of the backup file okay right okay how should we name this new theme we decided on mantis and the first uh, letter should be capital okay mantis i have here now the dot themes i thought that was the error it's open so what's gonna happen it's gonna copy paste it it's gonna name it and it's there and we can select it later on so that's great but uh script six will delete your per personal theme that's now the, the green one so let's do number six first and that's been removed and get number seven it's getting the original one from github uh, and install it again so that's that everything is now done has not been created the only thing we need to do is go to alex appearance and let's get rid of that and see for the mantis here it is the mantis the green one apply and everything is now green I better take a green icon set as well do I have a green icon set Eric do you have that I'm not a kind of I don't like the green color probably because I've been so long on, on Linux Mint in the past but here you have it there's something uh, green anyway in there um, well similar things oh yeah the evil pop is green as well of course maybe not so bad we have some contrast <laughs> but anyway you know it was successful we have these things in here you can put them in your personal home folder that's where we are a hidden folder or you can put them in here user share themes but then you have to copy paste them here but then they're not um, installed via pacman so we better leave them here that's my idea 
leave them here you can change them delete them to whatever you want because it's ho your home page it doesn't matter because here you can select them anyway so um, there you go my script still works and if you now have uh, uh, well ambitions to change or to make new themes please do there are only 16 million colors out there and so just copy paste that hexadecimal code inside of it, the uh, scripts and you have your own theme. Enjoy.